Back to TFS Plays Pokemon Soul Silver Nuzlocke. I'm Hiker Lanny. I'm Mountain Man Kieran. In the anime, I'm going back to school, and my name is Grant. The next anime arc, Ash is going to school. Ash right? goes to school? What? <laughs> yeah. Since since there are no what? gems and stuff in the next game, they're using this. He's going to Alola for school. Oh. <laughs> That's interesting. <laughs> this is summer vacation. I dislike his new design. Does like, he have a school a uniform? Uh, no, like he's wearing the, like I like his outfit fine. He's wearing the outfit that the- like, Uh, poor choice. Yeah, bad, bad opening yeah. move, friend. Uh, he's wearing the same outfit like the pro tag from the new game is. Like that uh -huh. blue striped shirt looks fine. Yeah. Uh, but they made his eyes like way smaller. Mm -hmm. And his head just looks, like he looks dumb. Like he looks like a, like, he looks like a goofy <laughs> cartoon character. Like he looks like the guy who's gonna get like the pies Is in this the face. just gonna be like a whole art style change for the next season of Pokemon or every, what? Every season of Pokemon they kind of redesign Ash a little bit. Uh, well yeah, they, and, want, and they want him to fit with the aesthetic yeah, of the new yeah. game. Yeah, and it's like, I feel like this one has, is like more extreme than I'm used to. No, I, I, I haven't seen it yet. What's this new season called? Is it just going to be called Pokemon Alola? Or is it like, I haven't, so, I haven't. Or are they just going to call it by the uh, game names as they have been for the last I couple? I don't know if it's been like officially like named yet. It's just, oh, I forgot we got rid of Earthquake. <laughs> <laughs> Rick Flair has retired from combat duty. Yeah. I don't know why, I just saw, oh yeah, Ric Flair, he's ground. That'll be fine. Because <laughs> <laughs> you assume we have a useful man with I, us. He's was, retired now. Too, look, the Flappy game, talking. look. Flappy got an unprecedented sighting. Ric Flair came out. Woo! <laughs> then he left and Cool Hand Luke murdered her. I just really <laughs> wanted to remind people that we did that. <laughs> that was pretty good. It was good it stuff. Good it was a yeah. good decision. Uh, yeah. Ric Flair needed to retire. No, it was, yeah, I'm not, I'm not hating on that decision. It's just, I forgot it in the yeah, heat of the I'm, moment. I'm glad that's what I came Sometimes back to. Sometimes we all forget that Ric Flair retired. I do. I do every day. I think, man, this music's just going to hit. The, the, nature, boy, the, the nature Boy is going to come back to Raw. Uh, I know up there is where we Fresh need young to go, talent. <laughs> but I can't remember if there's like a cool TM or something. So I'm going to go down. Well, there's a ball. Go too far. Electrode! Electrode! Oh, Max okay. Elix! Mag, eh, th sure. That'll be good for the Elite nah, Four, yeah, I suppose. Like the, I, can't, I can't get too mad. We're gonna have to endurance run the Elite Four. I'm furious. Do you look Look at this time you're wasting. <laughs> yeah, it looks like another wasted episode. Nobody died and they didn't beat a gym. <laughs> like, why are they even showing this? This should be a six episode long series. This is filler. <laughs> Nuzlocke yeah, filler. Yeah, welcome to Nuzlocke filler. Alright, if I try to go here, this is where Mount Silver would be. He's gonna be like, no, you can't do that. Oh! Only those who are beating the Elite Four can go! So, you know, that uh, one guy! And the other eight gyms, which are this way! Oh wait, this is the light of the Radiant City, you can't go here! Oh, yeah, that's right! Get out! We built this wall for a reason! There's <laughs> fucking Johto's coming in here trying to mate with our you women! To, you have to beat the Elite Four before you're allowed to visit another country. <laughs> yeah, then we'll give you, like, I don't know, amnesty? Is that the, I, I guess that's I the right so. word. I don't want to push it this way. They're really worried about getting poker Russ. Mm. Stop. Man, all I'm saying is that that like that extremist group, Team Rocket, is in Johto right now, and they just got yes. them out of their town. Yeah. Yeah, honestly, this is like the, what we don't know is basically Team Rocket had a huge terrorist attack on Kanto, and now they have really locked down on it's their foreign yeah. lockdown. <laughs> yeah, nah, and and we all know that they leaked in through Johto, so we gotta secure that border. <laughs> we gotta stop that. And we gotta make sure that the only people to get through are really strong Pokemon trainers that can do actual damage. <laughs> yeah. I don't know about you guys, but I'm a Team Rocket truther. I think uh, Kanto actually planned on this. Oh my gosh. You know what? I think that Giovanni's Mr. Pokemon guy, He's, He's in with Giovanni, yeah. is all I'm saying. No. Matt Osama Mark can't melt Giovanni. steel types. <laughs> Nobody <Nah>. knows. <laughs> ah. They call him the Pokemon Professor, <laughs> but we all know what he really is. What's he been studying? Where's his degree? I'll yeah, who up. gave him the Pokemon degree? Who let him do this? All right, this is a new route, guys, so if we see something we have yeah, I know. already caught. I'm, yeah. I'm keeping an eye out on that, that little ball. What, what could we get here? Is there anything I fun? Because I can't remember. Who is, knows? is Electabuzz in here? There might be like Machoke. 
maybe... Yes, Machoke, I think you're right. Maybe Haunter? Brandon Lee never did evolve. Yep, he never did. It's true. Man, ghosts are such garbage. I mean, they can be good, it's just... They're a bit better, th they're a bit better this when gen. In a Nuzlocke. Hey! Oh, Ursaring! Wow, we got the Mama Bear now! Uh, right. How do I not kill this thing? But <laughs> flashing it with Ric Flair a whole <laughs> lot. <laughs> It's like Camp WWE, where you fucked that bear twice. Well, hey, we got a bear right here. <laughs> uh, Mr. Steak still knows cut. He does know. He does know the move, cut. and he's eleven levels higher. Right. I'll a, take that. A crit fire blast, you know, might <laughs> fucking kill him. Ursa Ring knows something that's fire. I am. <laughs> oh boy, might want to heal him in general though. Yeah, we'll be yeah, we'll bad. Do that. Just a hyper. Uh, Who's the hype man of our team? The hype man of our team? It's probably Cool Hand Luke at the moment. Really? He just dropped the base. He's a DJ. Look, yeah, man, yeah, he, yeah, he, yeah, he yeah. drops it hard, and he keeps it He keeps it real. Keeps it fresh. Popping fresh. But at the same time, I feel like Mr. Steak is the front man. Like, he Mr. Comes, Steak he, is the, the front man. He's the front man, Slow but... Slow Mara is the powerhouse. Yeah. Like, like there's no doubt yeah. there. No, she's the anchor. No, that's Budge. The unyielding. Uh, yeah, that's yeah. true. That's right. Budge is the anchor. I like how unyielding means it won't stop, but then we say he won't budge. <laughs> <laughs> Look, man, there yes. are lots of there are lots of ways to go with budge. There we go. There it, it is. A little high crit. Wow. Let's swap out to budge just so oh, we yeah, can't get actually, hurt. Yeah, that's a much better idea than just <laughs> healing letting into your tickets. Budge. Hey, what's this? The unyielding! What up, Butch? Butch. <laughs> oh. oh man, that's doing way too much damage. We should yeah, use iron defense. Probably max. <laughs> we yeah, need, uh, we need to defend up. Iron defense. Yeah, you're right. We don't know how many Pokeballs this is gonna take. Exactly. This could take like 27 I Pokeballs. I feel like Budge could sweep the Elite Four if we just do Iron Defense and Bug Bite. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think there are enough Bug Bites. <laughs> yeah, they, we'd run out of PP. That's the only thing we would have. I did some like deep thinking the other day, which is very dangerous As you do. for me. Yeah. Um, we gotta see if we can catch him at Heavy Ball. We've it's never a pretty. Gotten... It's a bear. It's yeah, found it's, a way a bit. It's a big old bear. Uh, but um. Nope. Not big enough! Not, not heavy enough. Excuse me. I you. guess when you have living boulders, like a bear, it's not that big. <laughs> yeah, by, by, by comparison, you have a living lump of iron. Yeah. And a, like, yeah. uh, this creature is like three stories tall from time in memoriam and made of pure rock. Like, it's like, oh yeah, I guess that would weigh more. Friend ball. Yeah, it's our friend. It's our we friend. use the friend ball. Uh, was that over? Yeah, yeah, there it is, up left. there. Use that friend ball. We are friends here. Hey, boo boo. My strategy in the game, since my Pokemon playstyle is always like, I almost always play at night, I just buy as many Dust, dust Balls as yeah, possible. Yeah, dust, dust Balls is good. He was almost our friend, but now he doesn't want to be our friend, so now he gets shoved in a fucking Ultra Ball. <laughs> I was gonna say, so now, gonna say, so now we kill him! I was gonna say, so now we Master Ball. <laughs> we really want this thing. But I have another idea for our Master Ball. Don't you worry. Oh, don't worry. That you, Master oh, Ball shall be used. I, I have a very... Strong idea in my mother, motherfucker. Oh, we got rid of Yawn on everybody, so can't put him to sleep or anything. It's not like Budge is gonna yield or anything anytime soon, <laughs> so we're fine. As far as, like the rumor has it, the Budge is unyielding. So. Yeah, but yeah, that's, I hear rumors on the end. But anyway, uh, I was doing my deep thinking. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, that's right. You were talking about Budge sweeping the whole motherfucker. Continue. Uh, I did remember that one uh, one of the Elite Four members who is the Dark type focus. Has a Hound Doom, and I started wondering. Oh yeah, who, Budge would get wasted by that. Who would we use on that? Because Slomara. Oh wait, no, Dark. But Empire. Dark. <laughs> and it would be quicker. Uh, yeah, that yeah. one's that one's a little tough. Yay! So for that one, we might just have to like Slug power Bow. it out. Like Slugbo, like just add Budding it to death. Oh wait, well, yeah. That's the know only that. not fire type move it knows, and it has the same power Slugbo does, where it absorbs fire. Oh, that's great. Because <laughs> then like Slugbo is gonna get just keep getting fed. Yeah, because well, the AI is probably gonna be dumb enough to keep doing that. All right, what are we naming Lady Bear? This is like the mom. <sighs> Let's see. What 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 did we name our little girl bear? Uh, we, it wasn't a, it wasn't a little girl. It was a oh, it was general a little... general something. Oh yeah yeah General Paddington. Yeah General Paddington. Oh that's right. Queen Goldilocks. Uh, no. 
Hi, higher. No, no, cannot, can, you can't be a captain. You can't be a lieutenant. You can't be a lieutenant. Mm hmm. Major. Major. We have. We Ad, don't have a major. Admiral. We don't have an admiral. I like major. Major what? What? What is MJR? Is that the? Uh, I think so. Major. MJR. I wouldn't know. I don't know enough people that are in the military, the little one that have actually hit rank. <laughs> major. 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 Major Pain was a hysterical movie. Major Pain was an alright movie. Major. Honey. Claw. Honey. Hun suck. Hun 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 major. Claw. Bear. Claw. Claw. Okay, just write it as we go. Paw. Paw. Pawnee. 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 Major Pawner. Pawner. There we go. <laughs> we got Never there. gonna see the light of day, despite being one of my favorite <laughs> normal types. Hey, Mom, what's up? How are you getting- Tandor Sweetie, the house is on fire! Oh my god, I'm also- I bought you some stuff with uh, the money that you've been Click. sending me- <laughs> Just get a mash. Thanks, mom. To get out of that as quick as possible, because you have that amount of time to get all of the mom bits. Yeah. <laughs> this is gonna be a hyper cut at the end. Just do every mom call. Do we need to heal with Mr. Steak? So, no, not options. Poor Mr. Steak. Every so often, this DS just does not want to. That crit did a lot of damage. Yeah, it did. It was a stab, critical hit. But as we have proven, we can't kill Mr. Steak if we try. So, so good luck. So we decided to love him, which was way more difficult. <laughs> yeah. Man, he's never gonna die. Let's take him for granted. Let it be said for the record that I was always for Mr. Steak. No, I know you were the only one. I, I was the you only were true the believer. <laughs> you were the one who ended. <laughs> you, you, you made this happen. It's all my fault. <sighs> you did this to us. Come on, he's great. We love him. <sighs> Do we have any repels? We should yes. have a couple of max repels left. Because these are level 30. Yeah, but, yeah, the, but that's actually better. This is literally all considered. the training we're going to get before the Elite Four. Yeah. What's what's the highest level of the Elite Four? 50. 50 something, yeah. I feel you, man. I really do. <laughs> but we just can't abide here. No, I... All right, all right. As long as that was felt. We will still probably grind off screen, oh, but... most certainly. Yeah. The, but this... if I can get fun conversation while I'm yeah. grinding, rather than grinding in here in silence, I would much prefer the former. That is very selfish of you, Sorry Grant. Sorry the rest of you have to suffer with me. Yeah, you're pulling all of us down here now. Well, there's plenty of reason. Houdini was an onyx, by the way. I know we talked about Oh, that. yeah, never, Houdini. You never did guess what Houdini was. I never did. <laughs> See, we uh, while, while you were away, we uh, went through this uh, conversation chain of trying to name every Pokemon every Pokemon, Pokemon that has died. And we then, forgot and then oh, anyway. Yeah. We forgot Idrib, by the way. A bunch of people were just like, how could these assholes forget Idrib? Because it will not be missed. <laughs> yeah. Well, that, that was before we... we we were a different human. Uh, that, that, was, was that was very different. That was before the change. That was before the Nuzlocke had calloused our hearts. <laughs> that, was our, that was our first our first catch. Oh, it was. Right. I am a Graveler. Graveler, like, of the first gen Pokemon, always looked the dumbest. To yes. Me. Yeah. Yes. Like when I had a Geo Dude, I'm like, oh, Geo Dude, so cool, I'm, so cool. Yeah, then I find evolved into Graveler, and it's like, Ugh. and Golem uh, looks awesome. And like Golem, Golem. Lo Golem, Golem looks, looks fun, but as a kid that had very few friends, I could never get one. Yeah, exactly. Me neither. Golem looks cool, but he does not look like he matches with uh, no, he does Geo Dude or Graveler at all. Yeah. I wonder if there's like a fan third evolution that looks more in line with what I am sure there are plenty of artists out there. We go. We've, we've been south. Have we? Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we, we went south. We, we checked that way. And up we go! Hey, ladder! Oop. Going from the side. Trying to climb that. Scale it like a pole. <laughs> climb it like a fireman. So, 
I was a very, you know, as a, as a kid, um, I was always very like open with my parents. We had like, you know, kind of like friends, you yeah, know, relation type relationship. You had a cool. You can yeah, tell them anything. Yeah, they're like they're the cool, cool parents. So I remember, mom, um, I killed a hooker. Where do what do I do with it? Well, yes. honey, first you get the bell and saw, and yeah, my mom would yeah. help me in a heartbeat. Yeah, so that's why we have a big yard, son. I, <laughs> I um, live by a swamp for a reason. First was on the playground, and I was on, you know, they had like those little fireman poles, uh -huh. and so I was traversing up, up one, and then I felt a little tingle in my pants. Uh oh. Uh oh. And I was like, that felt really good. It's coming of age time. <laughs> and I was like maybe I think eight, and then and then I was eventually I was. Just I don't going. think there was any other way to go. Yeah, I think you're right. I, I found the pole, and then I went to my mom, and I said, Mom. I really like climbing these poles, but I feel like I'm doing something wrong. And she was like, Ah, good, you got the shame <laughs> built into you early. Yeah. The Catholic Church grabbed a hold of you. And I was like, I don't know why, but Jesus says this is bad. <laughs> yeah, and so because I was raised, I was raised in a Christian household, and I would just, I was always like, everything sexual, everything with my willy is bad. And <laughs> I was always like, oh, it's no. wrong. It, it feels really good, and I feel like I sh I should be punished, and I'm 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 really sorry. And she just started laughing, and she never answered me. <laughs> and so after that day, I was just like, I can never climb a fire pole ever again in my life. One of my fa uh, one of my parents' favorite stories to tell about me in terms of like the maturation of age. Yeah. Was I was like five or six years old, you know, like something around like it, like Aladdin had just come out. Okay. Yeah. And uh, I had a next door neighbor who was a female. She was a bit older than me. She was about 12. Uh -huh. Actually, she's probably about like 10 ish, 11 ish. Uh -huh. But for Halloween, she dressed as Jasmine. Oh and, boy. Uh, apparently, I walked up to my mom and dad and said, hey, would it be okay if Pamela had a sleepover sometime? <laughs> <laughs> That's great. I just want to spend time with her. Yeah, no, she's just really intriguing. <laughs> I can't wait to hear what she has to say. <laughs> so push it over one, yep. then we go down. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it! <sighs> They're trying cool to trip us up the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> These Graveler bitches just all over Cool Hand Luke. They, they want, yeah. like, look, just because he's the front man of a very, well, no, he's the... He's the hype man for a very, very good band right now. Yeah. All these, all these gravelers just run up there like, oh, send the, the back bulge. I just like the idea of <laughs> Cool Hand Luke, this elephant-like creature, like this mammoth thing, on a de like on a turntable with like no fingers, with just big stumps that they have. <laughs> just mixing tracks. Well, maybe we'll get a hit single from Cool Hand Luke next time on no, TFS. No, no, right now. What are we? Why are we? Why aren't you telling me things beforehand? You know what day it is. Yes, but we haven't done these for weeks. <laughs> well, now it's happening. Shimu Sumerimasu next, right? What? So what are you guys doing today? Uh, <laughs> right, so how are you doing? I'm I'm doing good. good. I'm I'm imagining a mammoth on a turntable, and that's just crazy. <laughs> and I can't I can't believe you like like you were saying. These bars are prehistoric. Shit! <laughs> 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 yeah. Cool hand Luke drops it hard. Drops another ice age. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to extinct your whole race! I wasn't even around for that event! <laughs> I'm just kind of the herald of the end of your time, that's all! I will say, the added benefit of having Slow Mara up front is those confuse rays never yep, go yeah, off. Yeah, yeah, yep. exactly. You can't confuse what is already lost. <laughs> I know everything! Yeah, Slow Mara has seen the other side of the veil, guys. You, you can't confuse her. She knows the truth. Facts the one do true not harm truth. me. She knows the real true truth. I'd say Man Crobat has an has an idea, an inkling. That <laughs> that void that was once his stomach taught him a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this one oh, learned and watched. Switching it up. He watched his brother die. That's all right. And what now shall go to join him. I was gonna say with Shell Bell, this should just undo that wing attack. <laughs> Assuming how much HP they have. Yeah, I forgot. How, I forgot how good Shell Bell was. Oh! Uh, only had a hundred or hundred and ten HP, not a hundred and one. Uh, so close. Then you gotta I'm, jump I, down. I think. Well, no, down is, is that, just. Hang is, on. Well, that's the only. That, that's down. Yeah, that's I know it. what you're thinking, but I think Do that's it. in. 
Oh. oh, okay, it's not! Alright! What the fuck? That was bizarre. Yeah, it looked like it would be in, but... Cause yeah, cause, cause, I, cause you can see where that drops down and it's just an area we walked past already. Yeah, so. yeah. It's like, this just, that makes this ladder useless completely, so there has to be a way around this. What do you think the Graveler, like, so a Geodude, when it evolves, sprouts legs and a second pair of, of arms, arms yeah. that then disappear and fold into its body <laughs> when it that... becomes a Graveler, or a Golem. Does ever? I feel like every sprite for Graveler has him with the other arms tucked in. Yeah, I think those are the Geodude arms. You think so? Yeah. Are those like the like the ancillary arms now? Like now we have like those. He's all excited for his new his arms. Dorsal so he's arms, like, if you will. Yeah, he just uses those <laughs> arms to like scratch its chest and like I don't know. They're slowly but surely folding into its being. <laughs> I'm losing my arms. It's okay. He's got a backup. Back up set. I still imagine that rock throw is him pulling off a chunk of himself, and then he just like rolls in the rolls in rocks and gets gets it back. I feel like all of so Geodude's Pokedex infos are like a lot of trainers trip over these thinking they're just rocks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So you think that Graveler is kind of like a non-Newtonian solid that can just rip shit out of its body? No, it's a it's a Newtonian solid, just made of sediment. Hmm. Like, and so it can. It's like, like a dirt can, clod. Yeah, and it can like, it can accrue more. Like it looks it looks more it looks dirtier than Geodude to me. Yeah. Something about it. I just kind of wanted to end. So all it just kind of scrapes its skin into like a ball of clay. Yeah, like. <laughs> yeah. They can just roll around and hey, now he's back. There we go. Now we got. Hey, back that our, that's our girl. And I think I saw an exit up there, so we may be closer. Drawing than close. To the Elite Four with not, perhaps not high enough levels. <laughs> no. If that's the case, it's just fine. gonna be a grindy episode. <laughs> and it's gonna be great, and everyone's gonna love it, because they were like, Yo, Kieran's back, where where's where, where them hour-long episodes be? We got Be you. careful what you <laughs> ask for, fools! <laughs> where's your fan art? Stay tuned! <laughs> <laughs> Foolish mortals. <laughs> Oh. oh, wait, hold on. This is not as simple uh, as I Eeny, meeny, miny, the bottom one. That's what they want you to think. I vote top. I vote bottom. I vote top. Oh, it's been so many years since I've done this! Listen to your heart. Hold on, we need yeah. to talk to Slow Mara. Let's talk to her about yeah. it. Yeah, she'll, she'll have an idea. She knows the true true. That's true. She's... I'm gonna say is one of us has direct access to your bedroom. <laughs> All I'm gonna say is one of us has direct access to your paycheck. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Which one is more important? <laughs> <laughs> the answer is the decision that's in your heart. Put your heart like down. Like I said, I'll leave it to Slomara. All right. If Slomara is like staring, let's see, let's focusly see, let's see or whatever, we'll we're going, see, we're yeah, going I, bottom. I trust yeah. you. We'll be able to interpret her based on what she says. Let's, All right. Let's scry. For what, now, what, now, what's, what's now gentlemen, it? no matter what decision is made, it is up to Slomara and my interpretation of Slomara. Are you speaking to us or the- Oh, oh hold on! Oak. Oh, we have service! Insight! <laughs> Insight! Hello, this is Professor Oak. Who the, the fuck, fuck are you? <laughs> did you just fucking hang up on is us? Is that a prank call? <laughs> How did you get this number? Uh, like I wanted to just like, <laughs> this is Professor Oak. Oak. Get a lot of Pokemon, aren't you? Get a lot of Pokemon, aren't you? Bye! <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, that Tantor guy. Good frog legs. <laughs> All right, what okay. say you, Slowy? Oh, she, did she just lean on? Whoa! But it, she's it, bumping us that way. Yeah, I was gonna say. She's bumping that way. She was bumping that way. I, I saw it too. Right. I saw it too. She's clearly heading towards that Ooh. one. Had her maybe she wanted to kill this grappler. Let's see if her disposition changes after grappling dies. <laughs> like, hold on, that grappler's going to stab you in the back, Tantor. I will take it so. They don't have souls. There's no Not anymore. There's no pokey heaven. They're data. Yeah, they're all data. Well, all right. Yeah, but Slow Mario, you changed something. your mind. Oh, yeah. That's still. Run! Run to the <laughs> hole! Run to the hole! <laughs> uh, well, that we might. Wanted to go up there. Oh well. This was technically the correct path. It was technically the correct path, but not the best one. It was not the most correct. <laughs> Slomara was just interested in getting out as quickly as possible, frankly. I, I can't say I blame her. <laughs> Have you seen these bats? They are massive. And very dead. 
I still think my favorite cosplay I've ever seen was at, I think it was at Yoma, with the, the two, the couple walking around as like Pokemon trainers. And they and were like, covered in Zubats. yeah, they had the little text box around Repel their neck. It was like, Repel wore off. And they had Zubats all over them. And I'm like, that's, that's really good. Really good. Uh, uh, I like those cosplays that involve a little bit more thought. Yeah. I mean, it's not just, I'm a character. It is, I'm a character in a situation. Or yeah. yeah. I like stuff like that. Specific setting. That... Something that makes, like, something that makes the photograph better. Shall we break through all of these? Of course. There's an item over there. I mean, Ric Flair's here. Woo! Woo! It's about to get progressively weaker woos as he's going Woo! to... Yes, back up. Woo! Woo! And the figure four rock smashes at it again! <sighs> and this is why he retired, folks. <laughs> Do Dark, Dark Pulse. Did anyone learn that? I'm actually kind of interested. Do we have a dark move that isn't payback? I know. Can Budge learn this? Budge's physical attack is much better. Oh than yeah. This. Yeah, we, they had, he has payback, which is fine. Eighty may also make the target flinch. That's good. Man, man, bro, come back, and back. Like but his special attack is his like special attack is not really good. It's bad. dicks. Oh, well. Sorry, Dark Pulse. For now, I am shocked that Slomara. I was gonna it. say that seems like right up her alley. <laughs> 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 the void. <clears throat> that would probably make you flinch. Well, hey, lesson learned. Ice Beam's gonna be super effective on this guy since we're running low on surfs. <laughs> oh, yeah! I remember learning that together. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it was great for that time we beat that dragon lady. Who, I guess, is not wearing a dress, is wearing a unitard, but from the angle in the game, looks like a dress. It looks like a dress. It absolutely does. Nobody blames you. What? Shit! Oh, fuck! No. <gasps> oh, man. Uh, he, he, lost to the, he lost to Mere Kimono Girls. Yeah. What's he doing here? Yeah, he can't. There's. He's not going to have anything. At least Lamar's at full health. And at least he has a fire type. Whatever, Scrotum! Let's go. Bring yeah. it. <laughs> fuck you. Oh, guys, got your full cool team. ass theme and your cool ass Sneasel. Fuck you. Okay, so who would be good against Sneasel? It were a Slugbo, who is not in our party right now. Um, because it's dark. It's dark ice, right? Yes. Yeah, but it shouldn't know any good dark moves, and any that it It'll does know, will not really hurt. Slamara. It'll know Sucker Punch. It, won't it know? I think it naturally learns Sucker Punch. Okay, so and, what, uh, what, what what would she have that would be any good against it? Surf would be stab and strong enough to I think Surf would kill it. I okay. Think Sneasel, Sneasel's a fairly Well, hold on, hold on. Let me put this out there. He had, like, we have one Surf. Fire type. And he has the fire type at That's the right. end. Oh, okay. So I'm right. saying swap out here into, I don't know, Budge? Budge. Budge, Budge, Budge will eat it, yeah. Yeah, Budge can, like, eat, uh, like, throw iron defense, throw out all the spikes, just murder everything. Oh, that's a good idea, actually. Because this thing, yeah, it's got an little faint attack. And I'll do, Probably like, no nothing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> spikes, spikes. Yeah, spi just spike them up. Ooh, lowering my speed. Tough man. <laughs> Too bad Spooky. I don't know Gyro Ball yet. The thing that is stronger, the slower I am. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Once Budge learns that, yeah, he when, will be a When does yeah. Budge learn that, or is uh, that a TM? I can't remember if it's a TM or if it's a level up thing, but like... I think Budge nat does naturally learn Gyro Ball at like... Probably like 50. I th yeah, I think 50. There. Maybe 52. Like once once he knows that... So it, it's like that that's a big move. It will be time out for everybody. <laughs> One more set of spikes and then just... Bug Bite, I guess? Yeah, probably. Uh, no, do, do Payback. But it's no, dark. it's 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 a dark type that'll that'll not. Bug bite may as well get the stab. Oh yeah, yeah. that's true. Bug bite gets the stab and is super effective on dark. So. Like, oh yeah, I forgot bugs. Bugs are super effective on dark. Yep. Yeah, that's about that. weird. Bugs dwell in the night, <laughs> don't you know? You're trying to chill out, Budge, but Budge is unyielding and does not really have a temperature preference. Yeah, Budge is chill as fuck. Budge will just do, like, just chill anywhere. I mean, it's fucking dead. Why don't oh we even bother God. with the spikes? Because <laughs> now everything else, now everything else, get else that comes yeah. out is going to get... Everything uh! else that comes out is going to be fucking dead. Unless, Unless he has a flying type. Yeah. Which he probably does. Hey! Oh, shit! Wait, hold uh. on. Oh! Uh. Uh. Nah, it's not that bad. It's Lil Mara time. It's no stealth rock. It's not stealth rock, but it's something. The one thing that could possibly it's, hurt Budge on his team. It's the thing that will potentially help us. Use Lava Plume! 
Oh. <laughs> Hello. Oh, you, <laughs> oh, you oh. dick! What an asshole! Hurting our attack like that. Do we surf or do we heal the burn? Surf will murder it, right? Just kill it. Alright. Because we can always just use a... You can always just do that? Yeah, we can always just use like a full restore or something later yeah. if we have one. Okay. What the fuck? A crit on Swift? He's a star! He's just so fast. I got, I got, I got scared for a second. Yeah, if like it was going down slow enough, that yeah. I'm like, if it survives that, what? Based on what comes out, uh, I may, I may leave it into heal because it could be something that knows pursuit and that would hurt really hard on my way out. Right. Because he has that scissor, right? Uh, he'll have a haunter. Oh, the, yeah, that's right, the haunter, which I. Haunter shall be able to murder anyway, though, right? So just heal her and kill the haunter. All right. Do yeah. we have a full restore? Uh, I think we have one. Yes, we, we have three. three. No, not potions. Not potions. <laughs> we can buy full restores now, right? Yes. Oh, we, we have, have, we have yeah, plenty. We have bought shit. That's also, we can go back to mom and withdraw all the money we've given her over oh, our adventure. that's right. We're going to have to visit mom. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, that's, that's right. right. Shadow, Shadow Ball. Ball. You're fine. Slow bros. <laughs> we'll be right back after these messages. Hi, it's Fitz with Slow Morrow. Forget about it. Motherfucking no! the shell necklace from around Slomar's limp body, puts it around his neck. He's wearing the shell bell. All right, so we're so we. He notices a faint glow. That then turns to nothing. <sighs> the words goodbye, Tantor, echo through his brain. Followed by a very long, followed by a very long and drawn out. Get out of this fucking cave right We're leaving. Now. <laughs> just, just, I'm gonna lose my mind. Just fucking this thing. <laughs> I'm gonna this lose my motherfucker head. right here. Nah, nah, nah. Mr. Steak's a plant type, and you're sending him against the flyer. I don't like that. <laughs> not after, not after what just happened. Fine. That's better. We have no time. What are we gonna do? The fuck is happening? How did? 
Take the shell bell first, because we said that in continuity, we took it in That's right, opinion. we take it! <laughs> this is the one item, the trophy that we take, because it was our sisters! <laughs> take it. Yeah. You shall live on. I'm glad you're pulling the trigger. Play the bagpipes. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Guys, I'm I've what? never seen that! What the fuck? I didn't do this! What the, I'm not even kidding! No! I, I didn't do that! What the fuck was that? I think I know why. Why? I think this is a mechanic in this game. <laughs> Oops. I think if it's the front thing, it's the thing that's following you. It can't. Okay. Vanish. So let's. Was that the will of God? <laughs> <coughs> no. Try it again. What, what the, the fuck? fuck? What are we Shake! Holy shit! <laughs> Karen! I did the- I, Again! Again! One more try! We're trying, fam! What? We can't! <laughs> Hold on a second, I'm looking this what up. What is this? We can't! Get rid of her! Is it like a, once you've maxed friendship, they can't be released? Or what? Something? Then no! Every Pokemon game you can release anything! What the fuck? I've released legendaries that have max friendship! What the fuck is happening? I, as much as I want this to be an hour long episode, I need a minute to process this. No, I... We'll see you guys next yeah, time we'll on TFS Plays Pokemon Soul Silver <laughs> Nuzlocke. What the fuck is happening? I'm honestly as awestruck as you guys. I have no idea what happened with that. We, in the decade of us playing Pokemon games, we have never seen that. And I swear to God, I didn't edit that in. I don't know who did. I have, I don't know, man. But by some fate, Slomara cannot die. You can't kill what's already dead. So she's gonna be resigned to a box. Uh, as so many of you have always said, to put him in a box. No, you gotta release him. But since we can't release her for some reason, she's gonna be boxed uh, for the foreseeable future. So rest in peace, Slomara. You were, you were great. And uh, I think you scared us all to hell. So uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed it, leave a like and let us know and make sure to stay subscribed for all your Nuzlocke goodness. If you guys want to check out some other stuff with us, we have over here on the left our last stream that we did with Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories over here on the left. Or you can check out on the right the finale to Naruto Dragon Blade Chronicles. It's such a bad game and it's up there with episode one nailed to the wall with us flipping it off because that game is god awful. And if you guys want to check out some fan art, make sure you stay tuned for the next five seconds because you might just get it. See you guys. Hey everyone, how's it going? Glad to be back here with some more Fan Art Friday. Sorry we couldn't give you guys a full hour, but as you saw, circumstances kind of prevented us from doing otherwise. So I hope you guys enjoyed what you got because holy crap, that blew all of us away. And your fan art was blowing me away. So I'm gonna go ahead and do some highlights. I know it's been a while since I've done it, so I'm not gonna get everything, unfortunately. Uh, at the end of this, I'm gonna try my damnedest to like archive everything and see if we can't put it on like Facebook or the new site or something. I'll, I'll try to do something for everybody because trust me, I do see every piece of fan art you guys send my way at KiraNSA underscore on Twitter. Make sure you send it that way because that is the way that I check to get all the fan art. So everybody's like, I made a Twitter account just to send us fan art. I love it and I love you. You specifically made this possible. So thank you. And now let's go ahead and get on to the first bit of fan art here. We have one from, I think, Drakenzorn at Drakenzorn 
underscore art. We have Ric Flair giving us a nice little Ric Flash. Got that woo. Everybody loves it. Who needs Earthquake when you got looks like these? Thank you so much, Drakenzorn. And then we have a next one here from Lucky S <laughs> I asked for Jerry fan art and I got Jerry fan art. I don't know what else to say, but thank you at Lucky Swordsman. I love this so much and I words can't describe it. I want a tattoo of Jerry. Thank you so much, Lucky Swordsman. That's great. Uh, we got next one here from Matthew McCarthy at Mr. Catchy 95. We got the big three. We got Tantor, Mr. Steak, and Slomara. Rest in peace. And all of us together for the big three here at TFS Gaming. Thank you all so much for the influx of art and everything. Even though I've been out of here, I have been checking up on all the art and I love this one. So thank you so much there, Mr. Ketchy95. Then we have one here. This is uh, one from Draco Wolf 92 sent this to me, said he commissioned it from Chimera Kid Fox at Chimera Kid with two Ds, Fox. And we have our queen who will never see the light of day. Rest in peace, Salad Fork, and rest in peace, Ivan Ooze. You will be loved. You will be missed. You will not be missed. You won't. <sighs> Nothing we're gonna be missed. Not gonna miss any of them. We have a next one here from KC Sparks at Kitsu Guardian with the evolution of Mer Stir Stank. And I thought that was so cute and super fun. And I just wanna. I just want to pet him. I want to have my own Mr. Steak. I thought this was super cute, Casey. Thank you so much for sending that one in. That one is adorable. We have one here from Bailey at Robo Finch with a lovely gif, a moving, an animatic image, if you will, a jiffy peanut butter of Allie McBeal causing an uproar. Thought that was super funny. And I hope you guys enjoy it as well. If you do, go ahead and hit up at Robo Finch on Twitter. Let her know. Let him, them, they know you love it. And we have another one here from Bailey at Robo Finch. We have Man Crobat and oh shit, it's Man Crobat. Gotta give him double your money. He's got that coin. You can't say no to that coin. Fess up, man. Give him the money. Where's the money at? Thank you so much for that one, Bailey. That one was really fun. Here's one from Trevor Tiger at Trevor Tiger Seven on Twitter, and it looks like Slamar continues to pester everybody, even outside of this digital world. She continues to scare all of us. And nice the Kiger shirt, by the way. Thank you for supporting us. You're awesome. Thank you so much, Trevor. And here's one here from Rachel Fisher at Ritonia77. Was had a conversation with her friend, and then this happened. We got Tantoritos. Now with more calories, you got more calories, nacho cheese flavor. You got Mr. Steak on the bag. You got a stop on the bag. What else can you want? Get yourself some Tantoritos right now. Thank you so much for that one, Rachel. Next one, we have one here from Hulksternator at Hulksternator on Twitter. We got Slomara's arrival through the TV. She's gonna come through your computer screen, through your television set. Be on the lookout because we don't know where she is anymore. She could be anywhere. Thank you so much for that one. And to wrap it up, we have one from Rory Fiddler at Dave, son of Dave. You know him, you love him. Here is this wonderful piece, which is more so than just the Nuzlocke. This also goes through Drunk Souls. We have Sigvard, our lovely onion, and Ivan, our lovely son, and Alex, our lovely friend, heading off into the sunset, where they will spend time not being missed. They were weak. They deserve to die. Thank you so much for that one, Rory. And I hope you guys had fun with these little fan art highlights. I'm going to go ahead and try to highlight a few more on uh, the time to come. Make sure you guys stick around for the weekend. We're going to have an episode for you. You're not going to have an episode on Sunday as we prep for the Elite Four. It's going to drop on Monday all together for you. So look forward to that, guys. I will see you all tomorrow. And I hope you all have a wonderful start to your weekend. Take care, everyone.